guest from out of town, or at least an hour away, we have uh, Max LaRocca. All right. Guys, you have uh, four minutes and 42 seconds to produce rings for our uh, judges. Ready, steady, shake. Come on, Andy. Come on, <laughs> All right, so uh, Andy, we might start with you. What's the uh, what sort of cocktail are you producing for us today? Me, I'm doing a sour. Um, uh, started off with an apricot sour, mm -hmm. and it's kind of evolved a little bit since then. Um, I'm using a little bit of manuka honey in it just to give it a little bit more of a, a little bit more of a complexity, I suppose. Um, and I've also added some passion. Cool. Fresh passion fruit? Yeah. Okay. The so. apricots, if I live in the South Hemisphere, I'll be just doing stuff with apricots. But we needed something to uh, spark it up a little bit. So a twist on a sour with uh, passion fruit, fresh apricots, 42 below uh, pure. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. And what's the name for your cocktail? Katie's Complexity. Katie's Complexity. Wow. Right. And uh, is Katie here today? No, Katie's not actually out of the world yet. She's still... Uh, Ah, uh, named for an, an, an unborn child. Bonus points. All right. <laughs> send, 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 send a mental vote. All right. I hope it's a girl. I already have a boy, so it's a good place. All right. Max, have you got anything more schmaltzy that can, uh, can, that can top that? I think I don't. What uh, what sort of cocktail are you making for us, Max? Uh, the cocktail I'm making is called the Teasing Bee. The beasting bee? Teasing bee. Oh, teasing bee, okay. It's, uh, it's, called, um, it's got some um, Anuka honey vodka. Yep. So you have this um, uh, honey taste that comes, goes, and comes back again as an aftertaste. That's why I call it the teasing bee. And uh, then you have uh, some uh, cinnamon syrup. Because we work with, uh, with the honey. And then, uh, we might put some uh, fresh uh, ginger to spice the things up. Uh, some uh, fresh uh, pineapple. And I think that's about it. Okay. Fresh yeah. ginger, fresh pineapple. Yeah. Some uh, 42 below manuka honey. Yeah. And uh, is this sort of an after dinner drink, pre dinner? Uh, it is. Yeah. After dinner? Yeah. Like the laundry. And uh, what are you using to add complexity to Katie here? Uh, <laughs> <You've got laughs> All right. And uh, any other liqueurs going in there? Uh, a little bit of Serona. Mm -hmm. Like I was saying, it, um, it evolved a little bit. And I'm some, you know, apricot, almond, carrot. Yep. It's a wonderful, uh, wonderful combination. So I'm giving a little Frangelico spray because I, I like the notion of Frangelico, mm -hmm. but I'm actually using Serona just to give it a little bit more flavor because I like the, the depth of it. So a little Disserono, Amaretto, Frangelico spray. Halfway through for time, guys. And some egg white in the sour. Yeah. Cool. Uh, you've got yeah. a minute and a half left. I'm up next. I'm up next. He can't talk right now. I <laughs> can't talk right now. Are you a fan of the? Uh, <laughs> are you a fan of the sour drink, obviously. Yeah. Yep. It's like a big whiskey drinker. Right? Yep. <laughs> so that's real manuka honeycomb, which is going in there as well. Yeah, it's pretty yep. good stuff. My buddy brought it back from New Zealand. It's pretty high UMF. That, so mm -hmm. I tried to get some in Tesco, but it was actually from Australia, so I'll probably lose points. They see it every. Get your second. Come on, Andy. Right. <coughs> so Max is just about finished with the uh, teasing B. Little crushed ice on the top. And 30 seconds to go, Andy.
You've got a, you've got a teasing wasp uh, pretty close to you there. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, a pineapple leaf, and what was going on the top there? Was that cinnamon? Cinnamon, yeah. Yep. And then we have some honey, uh, just uh, caramelized and make into spiral, and uh, pineapple leaf. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Alright, fantastic. Wow.